What's going on, everybody? Z here. Welcome back to some more Steamy Satisfactory. That's right. We're playing the Steam Save. We're back. We're doing the things. We're doing the stuff. Last episode, uh, we went and got some basic steel production -y stuffs going on. We got some pipes. We got some tubes. We got some beams or whatever they're called. What are they called? I don't remember what they're called. They're these things right here. Steel pipes. That's what we got. So, uh, yeah, we're going to work on getting probably advanced uh, steel production. I'd really like to get Logistics Mark III as well. Uh, actually, we could probably go ahead and do that, but I think, mm, I think the conveyor belt Mark III actually requires the production of encased industrial beams, so that really wouldn't help us out a whole lot if we went that route uh, directly. So we're gonna start with this. Actually, what I'm gonna do, yeah, what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna actually clear up my inventory a little bit, and um, I'm gonna go back and grab some steel pipes and beams, and then let's see. Okay, let's sort. Let's sort. I want to store all, but I actually want. Oh, Gosh, of course it stores, it stores all the stuff that I want to keep, you know? <gasps> Go figure! Okay, all right. We got some things stored here. Now, uh, oh, actually, hold on a second. I needed this concrete, didn't I? Why don't I just deposit that and be done with it? Okay, so concrete's good. Uh, we need what? Wire, rotors, and pipes. We need some pipes. Uh, okay, so let's go grab some wire. We should have wire. Should be over here. Hopefully, maybe. Yeah! Uh, we need what 1500 so there's one two there's 1500 do we even have 200 rotors right now i have no idea i have no idea it's been so long it feels kind of good to be back though i'm not gonna lie all right i think rotors are being made on this level here um da, 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 da. rotors no those are not rotors. <laughs> where are the rotors going oh Oh, we have 200 steel rotors. Fantastic. Are you still running? Are you still doing the things? Yes, it is. Okay, cool. Uh, we got 200 rotors. Easy peasy. So we have those. We have those. I just need to go get the pipes. And whoop. No take damage. Don't take damage. I really need to go get the blade runners too. So if we could find some Caterium, that would be amazing. Uh, actually, how full is this guy? Are you like completely full? Nah, not quite. All right, perfect. Um, Boom, boom, boom. Those are good. That's good. That's good. Now we just need those pesky pipes. Um, and then hold on. What else do we need? Active milestone, select milestone. Okay, hold on. I just want to see what do we need? Oh, we need hyper tubes as well. Okay, so more pipes for that. Oh, we're needing case industrial beams as well. Um, basically, I'm just going to go grab all the pipes and the bars that I can. And we'll take a factory cart. Hello there, steel production. How are you doing today? Mighty good, mighty good. All right, so let's grab uh, a bunch of those. And then we need a bunch of these. Actually, we probably can just take all of those. And we'll grab another stack of pipes. Why not? Might as well. Let's see. Is there anything else that we need here? Not really. Not really. That's pretty much it. All right, back to the base in the mini cart mobile. And let's go ahead and feed it the pipes that it wants. Advanced steel production. We just unlocked some things. Improved miner included the <gasps> double extraction rates and improved double efficiency of new extraction pipelines. rates. Heck a yes. Of new, more complex parts is now available for crafting. An additional project part can now be constructed. Further progress to the next phase is now possible. All right, so now we can make encased industrial beams, stators, motors, automated wiring and heavy modular frames wonderful now i really want this guy too because i want the xeno basher but hyper tubes would be really good and the, honestly the conveyor belt mark three is actually what we need actually we have the stuff for it um can i go ahead and just start applying that stuff might as well right and then all i need is some concrete heck yeah that's a win and voila there's that one wait there was no timer there was no timer on the other thing Logistics Holy moly. Improved with a larger storage container and enhanced conveyor belt efficiency. All right. So if I'm not mistaken, the new conveyor belt requires. Oh, it only requires beams. Ew. well, you know what needs to be upgraded first is we need to get we need to get the uh, the exports upgraded. Wait, hold on a second. So I need to actually unlock the next phase to get conveyor belt mark fours, which is the encased industrial beams. No, <laughs> darn it. Okay, that's fine. That's fine. We have some beams already. Uh, I want to go ahead and upgrade the belts coming out of these because this guy right here is already moving. Wait, actually, that one's moving at maximum speed already. And it's fine. Yeah, this is actually running at like 100% efficiency right now. That's actually quite nice. Oh, it's these guys. <gasps> these are the ones that need upgraded. I don't have enough to do with this whole line right here. I'm sorry. I just, I don't. 
so i would say the first line that we really should consider upgrading is probably the screws because those are the ones that are typically uh the slowest because there's just so many darn parts per minute you know what i mean so this actually should be the belt that we first upgrade but um i'm not gonna mess with that right now either because i only have 136 and that is not a lot not a lot to do anything with it kind of seems like what we need to do is we need to ramp up production of steel stuff all right so we gotta expand we gotta expand our uh our little our little steel factory over here so we're gonna go work on that i love how like squatty this thing is it's so funny we're gonna go work on that but in the process we're gonna actually start making some encased industrial beams as well because we're gonna start needing those for stuff and um we need those for we need it for a few things so i'm gonna start getting a little a little area set up for those just so we can get some production of them going for now but steel we definitely have to ramp that up a little bit so we're gonna go work on that you know i found our caterium right there <laughs> it's literally right there oh my gosh okay so we know we're gonna build the uh, little caterium area we should just do that too we might try to knock that out this episode as well i don't think it's gonna take me too long to get this uh this area ramped up a little bit more um i don't think so oh look at that we fell over but we're good we saved it okay now how is this going is this backed up at all this is kind of backed up or it's just super slow it's just oh running low on the coals i see that's not great that is not great okay um shoot i need to put a foundry here let's do this let's disable this for now wait no stop it okay disable that that way these guys can flow on out and where are we gonna expand out to I guess we can expand this way let's do that let's start expanding out this way a little bit all right perfect how are you are you almost empty come on empty out now <laughs> these belts are the slowest belts in the history of mankind my god what are they level ones they are level ones no it's because i made them level ones that was awful all right well while i'm waiting for those to empty i'm gonna go make a platform over here for the caterium stuff because we're gonna do caterium stuff here anyways all right that's a pretty good platform right now for uh for the caterium stuff now i know what you guys are saying i know i know what you guys are saying man he is playing fast and loose with the whole base building thing well you know what that's right i am because this time i don't care i'm not trying to keep everything amazingly organized in one giant building oh no sir we're gonna spread across the map like a nasty nasty virus it's gonna be good we're gonna go everywhere we're gonna have little factories just everywhere it's gonna be a complete disaster chaos if you will but it's gonna be good chaos oh it's gonna be fun no longer shall i be bothered by having a symmetrical bit well okay you know what things might try to stay symmetrical a little bit it feels like that that's just pure anarchy there uh but i you know what last step last last season last deal i just tried to get everything into one thing i tried to make it all look nice and you know i was like no mm -mm, no sir form function over form this time not form over function function over form that's how we're doing it are you still not empty oh thank goodness you are you're almost empty come on buddies you can do it and she's empty perfect okay so i want to place these as close as i can to each other <gasps> like so and like so and we'll go ahead and throw another one right here why not uh maybe we will will, will you squeeze in right here no <laughs> the belt is just barely in the way <gasps> that's fine be gone belt be gone Ta -da! all right we've done it my gosh it's amazing i know i know can we can we squeeze a uh can we squeeze a container in here that would be that would be nice uh let's see here can we get you lined up no all right hold on let's see uh oh, 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 that's gonna be a tight squeeze that's not possible oh this is great uh maybe we can fit a container right here come here how's that gonna work is that gonna work maybe no because this is blocked now uh we might not have a we might not have a little buffer zone we might not have a buffer zone that's fine that's fine we don't need a we don't need a buffer zone anyways let's do uh one of those and like one of these and you better go through here thank goodness i did not want to have to deal with that there's that perfect my gosh we've done it all right i think everything's hooked up i think i think we're good to go on this front uh now we just gotta get everything hooked up on this side that is too easy you know there's a slightly good chance i might run out of belts here because i didn't i didn't bring the stuff for the belts because i wasn't even thinking about it i was like ah we're not gonna need plates for anything well shoot i might have been wrong okay i think i think that's good so there to there i think we're good 
All right, those are all hooked up. We got three of them. Oh, we need some power now, though, huh? And voila, steel ingots aplenty. Okay, so there's that. Uh, more steel ingots going into this area. We need to expand out. Oh, man, we got to make so many more of these things because I feel like we're going to have enough steel being produced for all of these. We just got to get belts up faster, too. We need more belts, more everything, more everything needed. You know, I'm half tempted just to get rid of these making the pipes because I don't need any pipes right now for anything. I need more beams than anything. Let's go ahead and let's do a quick swap a Rooney here. Let's turn these into uh, turn these into beams as well. All right, so those are all beams. That's fantastic. I might actually have enough to upgrade some stuff now. Now, my question is, is anything getting actually backed up? I don't Oh, uh, Yeah, it actually kind of is, huh? All right, let's start with some upgrades on these and hopefully we can feed our uh, our machines a little bit quicker. Oh, holy moly. Look at them go. Look at them go. They're going so fast. Oh, because those went from one to three. Those went from Mark 1s to Mark 3s. That's why they're so much faster now. Oh, it's amazing. That's such a good feeling. Okay, we need to upgrade this guy as well. All of that, all of the coal lines to make sure those are going. Now, I also need to see you. Do we have a limestone nearby? Probably not. Oh my God, we do. <laughs> Where are you? sweet sweet limestone ah uh, it's probably all the way on the ground oh yeah she's all the way down there i mean i guess we could elevate her it up right i mean shoot that's not that bad where was that other one at 416 380 i thought there was one over here nope this is the one that is the one hopefully we can put a uh, a mining thing right there i don't know with these things going over the top i don't know if that's gonna work so there is a slight problem the first machine getting fed iron has the most in it and the first machine getting fed coal has the most in it but those two machines are on different ends of the spectrum here <laughs> because this machine has the most iron but no coal and that uh, that machine down there has all the coal but no iron so only these ones like the ones in the middle are the only ones like actually functioning worth a darn because like look see this thing has no iron but it has coal i guess the easiest upgrade would be to upgrade this belt right here huh all right, there. So iron belts upgraded, even though the elevator is not. We need to get that guy upgraded as well. So come here, Mark Three elevator. Boop. Good to go. All right. So hopefully they'll start feeding iron down here as well, a little bit more. How much are you making per minute? Jeez, Louise. 120. Okay. So this could be upgraded to a Mark Two. That would be handy. Because right now it's just emptying out the. Um, it's backup so yeah well that should hopefully fill up these things pretty quick all right i guess it's time to work on the coal line here try to get this guy upgraded mark three boop uh mark three i don't we're not gonna make it all the way down there i know we're not yeah we might maybe no darn it i know we're not we're not gonna make it no way we're gonna be just a, we're gonna be a little little teeny tiny bit shy Looks like we are one elevator shy of getting this guy fully upgraded to Mark III. Darn it. I need more, I need more beams. Now, you know what's actually fantabulous about this design is I can actually put it just like this, except opposite. And we already have the splitters and whatnot made. They're good to go. They, they're already there. We don't have to worry about it. And I think, let's see, how does that look? Uh, oh, that's like super far away. Yeah, they, they can be a little bit closer than that, too. I think that'll work. And then we can just boop, put these right into there, split them off again. Oh my gosh, it's amazing. I'm just gonna go ahead and build all the ones that I can. <gasps> these weren't evenly spaced. Uh, well, don't care. Now, I can't do this one, obviously, because this line's coming in right here. Uh, yeah, no, I'm not even gonna deal with it. How's our power looking? <gasps> Ooh, we're getting close. We're getting close. And the final upgrade. Oh, come on. Give us that sweet, sweet coal. Wait, is that, is that a Mark three? It's a Mark three, right? Yes. Mark three, Mark three. Okay. Uh, looks good. Wow. That must not be a pure node. Cause that thing is going super slow. Oh, we need to upgrade that. All right, we'll just go ahead and let that run for a little bit. Let's go get some stuff set up for the Caterium stuff. Now, I'm going to have to do some research on it, so I can't really like do a whole lot with it, but I can go ahead and make some constructors. 
uh and some smelters actually let's do smelters first and i don't have the stuff to make like any of the uh any of the mines right now so i mean that's unfortunate all right so that'll be what Caterium, quick wire easy peasy uh and then we're gonna have to get the um okay we're gonna have to get the the concrete and i'd like to go ahead and make reinforced or in uh, in case industrial beams as well so i'd like to get a little spot set up for that uh we'll probably just put that right here because there's that guy so let's go ahead and build out a little area right here might as well okay so that area is good uh let's see in case industrial beams will need an assembler actually if we're gonna be making concrete right here you know it might actually be better to put the assembler over here basically i can already tell you right here this whole area is gonna turn into a whole bunch of fun goodness it's gonna turn into like everything but that's all right uh let's put the assembler right there we'll build out you know make it another thing and this guy is actually going to be in case industrial beams because that's what i want it to be and for the final bit we're gonna go ahead and upgrade these um these miners right here heck yes we are Okay, so let's see what's going to here. Minor Mark II. Uh, boop. Look at that. Good to go. And are you firing up again? 240 per minute? Heck yes. That's exactly what we needed on this guy. Okay, you should start spewing in. It's like, pfft. come on. Come on. You can do it. You can do it. It still hasn't spun up yet. It's because it's not working. It's because it's not working. Uh, hold on. Logistics mark three. Okay. Boop. And then boop. Okay. Will you work now? Yes, it will. All right. That's not even the one that needed it. The one that needs it is the coal for sure. So we're going to go do that one right now. Now, I don't think there's any way that I reached that from here. Did I reach that from here? Maybe I did. Oh my God. We did it. We reached it. But now it's not going to produce. So I'm going to have to take this guy out. Now I'm going to add a new one in right there to right there. Perfect. Oh, show me. Show me the coal. How's our power situation? Uh, it might get rough. It might get rough. Oh, look at all that wonderful coal that I'm guessing is probably producing 120 per minute because I don't think it was a pure node to start with. Uh, but we do have plenty of cop. Uh, we have plenty of coal over here. So if we need the coal, we can get the coal. Now, another one that I want to upgrade is actually the one feeding our power because we're going to have to uh, we're going to have to increase our power output because we're getting we're getting close. All right. So uh, how do you feel about an upgrade there, Mr. Miner? Oh, you like it? That's good. I'm glad. All right. Let's get rid of this guy. We'll go ahead and put a Mark three on there. Oh, I hope I have this stuff for a Mark three. I do not. <laughs> Most definitely do not. Uh, OK, well, let's get at least get the Mark one back in there. Perfect. OK, so that will work now we didn't need the coal right now but we're going to because we're gonna have to uh expand out our our uh our power here because we're eventually gonna start getting a little close to it all right how's everything looking now uh we're still running rough on coal hmm do we do we ever unlock uh overclocking yet Ooh, we did and I do actually have a couple of slugs back at the main base. Uh, you know what? Let's do a quick upgrade. Let's do a quick overclock on that coal miner down there and try to pump out some more coal. Cause what Mark threes can handle is a 270. It's 270. So if we get closer to 270 with that guy, cause I right now it's at 120. So if we did one more, that's what 25% or is that 50% more? So it would take us up to 180 and then 240. So yeah, two slugs should get that guy up to 240. Uh, and then that should help our steel production, which should in then turn help with our beam production. You know what? I have the stuff to make a workbench and there's a slug right there. Ooh, do I have any way to build up to it? Uh, no, <laughs> never mind. Hello, Mr. Slug. Oh, I have three slugs. Ooh, <laughs> extra fancy. Ah, uh, power shards. Yes, not enough space in inventory. No. <gasps> oh, I have four. Oh, I've got a yellow one too. What? Oh, well, I don't think I can do the yellow one yet. I can't. Uh, let's go ahead and put away two of those. I don't need those, but I do want that guy. Ooh, four power shards. Heck yes. Things are about to get hairy. We actually have to go down there. Oh no. We actually have to go down there. And there's the spiders or cats. The cats. There's cats running around. I have them as cats on this. Oh, they're going to be running around. They're going to be terrifying. And I'm going to be stuck down there with them. Okay. No kitty faces. With the quickness. 
one two three and boom uh, no i don't need three 240 perfect okay all right run 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 i can't get up there uh can i just have like a foundation here and then up here no no come on okay we made it md construct you and we're good okay perfect okay so that one's running at uh maximum capacity let's see now how our steel is doing it should be doing a little bit better now oh look at that we got coal actually coming in it's actually coming down here too and as the things start filling up we should hopefully have enough i'm gonna let this run for a minute i want to see how uh, i want to see how close we're gonna get to to hopefully being able to get all these running at maximum capacity here i don't know if we're gonna be able to hook up these yet i might be asking a little bit too much oh we just killed the power <laughs> darn it i knew we would oh we barely spiked come on no oh my gosh we spiked a lot well i guess we're not gonna be letting those run are we hmm i actually have enough stuff on me to build another coal generator maybe that'll fix our problem all right there's that uh let's go ahead no are you kidding me i don't have enough a splitter uh you know what that's fine we're gonna do this you're gonna come down here we're gonna spaghettify this you're gonna go there and then you're gonna go into there uh, just like a so and then this guy a uh, boop and a boop that works for me oh 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 come on yes okay all right come on Okay, come on. Come on, you can do it. There it is. That was the coal generator. Yes! We we have enough power. <laughs> we have enough power. It's working. It's actually working. I'm going to say that the next thing we need is hyper tubes because I'm getting sick and tired of running back and forth on this stupid path to get from point A to point B. This is a this is terrible. It's it's tragedy. All right, so we should be getting coal in here again and hopefully it'll be running good enough to where we can actually be producing enough what we need to be producing maybe these these you know what it'd be nice if these things eventually started um getting full we need more of those that would be amazing so i'm gonna go out on a limb and say this should be good because we're already running the the iron is start it sometimes backs up a little bit so that makes me think that if the coal's running at the same rate and they require the same amount the coal should start doing the same they should both should be good but i don't know because this one isn't always running so that could be the reason for the backup too i think it was, it's gonna be close wait well hold on a second we need 45 of each per machine i think we're gonna be really really close we're gonna be super close actually so we're gonna need 270 of each which means we could actually make this 100 percent efficient if i put in where are the slug shards? If I put one in here, brought this up to 270, and I put one more, actually, we'll just, we'll just oh, geez, Louise, that puts it at 360. And if I put one more in the, uh, the coal, it'll be exactly enough for these to be running full time. And we'll have maximum outputage of steel. All right, let's make it happen. Make it so. All right, one more slug going in. Let's take it to the limit. Take it to the limit. 300 heck yes that will do it okay so the machine the machines we have running will be fine they will be completely supplied with no issues because 270 is the maximum limit on the belts and there's only one belt going to each uh each one so that's perfect that's absolutely perfect we got it we've done it and that is going to end this episode hopefully you've enjoyed if you have please don't forget to leave a like if you're new here don't forget to subscribe as well for some more and leave a comment down below you guys want to see some more are you ready for some more sas factory is it time to jump back in and start building factory stuff let me know leave a comment below and you have an absolutely fantastic rest of your day i'll see you in the next one